Epidemic Typhus by Laura Depati. What is it? The name of the disease is epidemic typhus, also known as jail fever or camp fever. The name of the microbe that causes it is Rickettsia proezecchi. It is a bacteria. The first description of the disease was in 1083 in Italy. Before treatment was found in World War II, epidemic typhus would have occurred in after wars, famines, or natural disasters. What are the symptoms? The symptoms are high fever, severe headaches, joint and muscle pain, confusion, low blood pressure, sensitivity to the light, chills, coughs, rash that's just in the middle of the body and spreads everywhere save the palm of the hands and the soles of the feet, and stupor, meaning lack of awareness. What is the incubation period? When you have the disease, there are first few days of discomfort. After, the other symptoms appear suddenly. Both will overtake 10 to 14 days after you were first exposed to the disease. How does it spread? Epidemic typhus is spread through the human body laos. It becomes infected by one host with typhus fever by sucking on their blood and transmit the disease to a second host by putting Rickettsia proezecchi into the bite wound. How can it be prevented? Good sanitation and hygiene, boiling clothes or avoiding infested clothes for a minimum of five days as laos die within five days without blood and using insecticides. Avoid contact with the human body laos and use insect repellent. Treatments and cures. Untreated epidemic typhus has a death rate from 10% to 60%, older people having a high risk. And during World War II, 3 million Russian soldiers died. Antibiotic therapy is recommended. Antibiotics include azithromycin, doxycycline, and tetracycline. Are there any future problems that may have an impact on society? A problem that may occur in the future is another outbreak of the disease. For example, when an epidemic of the disease occurred in 1489 in Granada, Spain. Bibliography Thank you for your attention, and I hope you enjoyed my Powtoon. Created using Powtoon.